feel so ill today. Hey everyone, I don't feel like I'm in the middle. Does that bother you? Like, if I'm not in right slap bang in the middle? I don't know if it bothers me. Do you even notice? Am I being paranoid? I don't know. I'm gonna stay here. If it bothers you, let me know. In today's video, I'm gonna be doing the 40 makeup slash beauty questions tag. But before I start, I thought I'd give you all a little update about where I've been and just life in general. So like for the past week, I've been really ill. You can probably hear my voice I'm still a little bit. I'm still a little bit ill, but um, today is sort of the first day where I've been feeling slightly better. So I thought I'd just film a video and um, yeah, get that done. In terms of like generally where I've been, um, if you watched my last video, I did mention briefly that I've moved now. I've moved area and I've moved a flat, well, I wasn't in a flat before, but I'm in a flat now. Anyway, so, um, I am in a different location, hopefully a bit more permanent than my last couple of locations that I've been in. So, that was a bit stressful and that was why I went like two months without film filming any videos. But I'm back now and hopefully we'll be getting more regular videos, I've got a couple of ideas. But do let me know if you have any specific requests of things you'd like me to film and I'll get them done for you. So the first question is, um, how many times do you wash your face? Uh, I wash my face twice, I don't know if that's normal, like twice a day. Uh, what skin type do you have? I've got combination skin type. What's your current facial wash? My current facial wash is the Tea Tree Oil Body Shop skin clearing foaming cleanser i've used this for a long time now and i really believe in the power of tea tree oil it clears up my spots it's just a really good cleanser to use do you exfoliate yes i do occasionally um what brand do you use um for my body i just use like a super drug sugar i don't know sure i think it's a sugar like a sugar scrub and then um, for my face sometimes i'll use the st ives apricot scrub what moisturizer do you use I use simple moisturiser, always use simple, it's the best for my skin, I've got quite sensitive skin, so simple products are always really good. Do you have freckles? No, I wish I had freckles, I love freckles. Do you use eye cream? No, I don't use eye cream, I don't think I need to, well maybe I do, but I just don't. <laughs> Did you or do you have acne prone skin? I don't think I have acne prone skin. I've had like breakouts and I have had like really bad um, periods where I've had like really bad spots but I've never had like proper like all over my face acne pro I don't think I do have like pro skin is the short answer did you ever use proactive no and I don't know what proactive is what foundation do you use I just started using the Maybelline fit me foundation in the color 120 this is a little dark for my skin but I really like the formula um, it's really mattifying and yeah, just really good coverage. How about concealer? I use two concealers. Uh, I use the Lasting Perfect Perfection and this is in the colour of One Fair. And I use Match Perfection. I don't know what colour this is in, in 30 Classic Beige. I mainly use this for my under eye and this is usually used for spots. Do you know your undertone colour? Uh, I did know it, but I don't know. I'm not sure I forgot. What do you think of false eyelashes? I love false eyelashes. I used to hate them. I could never wear them, but now I really love them. I think they make a difference. I don't wear them like every day. Like now, I'm not wearing them to film. But if I go out, I'll wear them. Do you did you know you're supposed to change your mascara every three months? Um, I think I did, but I don't think anyone does because mascaras are bloody expensive. And if I was to change my mascara every three months, I would be broke as hell. What brands of mascara do you use? I use Maybelline Lash Sensational. Love, love, love this. It's amazing. Um, sometimes I will use YSL Baby Doll. Really nice. Separates lashes really well. And is very voluminous as well. And I also use Better Than Sex by Too Faced. Which is another classic mascara. If you want something a bit more clumpy. A bit more sort of. Like a, how do I describe like a 90s look. That's a really good mascara for that. Sephora or MAC? Um, definitely MAC, but I've never been to Sephora, so it's kind of by default. Do you have a MAC Pro card? No, I don't. What makeup tools do you use in makeup application? Use my fingers. I use beauty sponges, 
I use brushes and I use artiste brushes. Now, do you use makeup based primer for your eyes? Yes, I do. I use the Urban Decay Primer Vision. And for the face, for the face, I use makeup. Sometimes I use want something to like reduce my pores, and I'm not that worried about like moisturising. I will use the Makeup Forever Step One Skin Equaliser, and if I'm more like, you know, wanting to look after my skin a bit more, I will use the Collection Primed and Ready Reviving Anti Fatigue Illuminating Primer in Warm Apricot. And this is really moisturising and uh, very very fresh. What is your favourite eyeshadow? I don't know, there's so many to choose from, but I think the one I have to pick, um, simply because I probably use it the most, or colour similar at least, is the colour Busted in the Naked 2 palette. It's just like a classic dark brown, and I feel like dark brown for me is such a nice colour when I want to sort of glam things up a bit. Um, it just is really nice. And I like it. Do you use pencil or liquid liner? I use both. I've started using Urban Decay 24-7 Glide on Eye Pencil in the colour Smoke as a pencil liner, just the waterline. And if I'm using a liquid liner, it will be Clinique Pretty Easy Liquid Eyeliner Pen. I actually love this liquid liner. It's really good. Uh, I've gone through a lot of liquid eyeliners in the past year because I really just needed to find one that would work for me and this one is really easy to apply. Got it on today. Um, I feel like you just have a lot of control over it, which is very important when it comes to liquid liner. What do you think of pigment eyeshadows? I love pigment eyeshadows. Heck yes, like they give the best look in terms of popping, in terms of wanting to stand out. Um, if you're if you're bold and you want to go bold with your makeup, pigment eyeshadows are great. I mean, they're messy, but they're great. What's your favourite lipstick? This was such a hard question for me because I have so 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 many lipsticks. Um, but I whittled it down to. I was like, okay, I'm just gonna choose one. Advice. I'll just have a whole lot. I whittled it down to the Kat Von D liquid lipstick in. Colour Lolita. This is just a classic nude slash pink colour. I think it's very versatile, very unique though in some ways because although it is nude, it's a bit, it's a, you got a little something, something as well. Like it's sort of like a darker pinky, sort of just really nice, and also it's just really comfortable to wear, which is lovely as well. Because a lot of liquid lipsticks are on, unfortunately. Favourite lip gloss. I don't actually use lip gloss a lot, but if I had to pick my favourite one, it would be the Dior Lip Lip Gloss Ultra Gloss in colour Shock. Um, I just love the packaging. How beautiful is it? I think everyone loves the packaging of them. They're just so lovely. The actual formula is really nice. What is your favourite brush? Now, this was hard as well. But I think in the end, I have to go for my trusty MAC Artiste brush. And um, I just love this. This is in oval 6, I think. It was expensive, for sure. But I just love, love, love applying my foundation with this brush. I just love the look of the Artiste brushes as well. I think they're really pretty. Do you buy your makeup online? And if so, where? Uh, yes, I have bought my makeup online, like, pretty much everywhere uh beauty bay cult beauty i've bought it from boots and superdrug as well do you like drugstore makeup yes who doesn't i love drugstore makeup especially when it's like a really cheap brand like um makeup revolution or anyway and they've just got amazing products like what more could you want did you ever consider taking makeup classes uh yes yeah, I really did, and I still would take a makeup class any day. I love learning about makeup. Um, it's something that I just, I just don't think that I would ever get bored of, um, which is weird for me because I usually get bored of things pretty quickly. So yeah, definitely, I, I think I would find it really interesting. Um, at the moment, I'm not going down that path. 
but it's definitely something that I wouldn't like say never to. Are you clumsy in putting makeup on? Uh, yeah, I think I am. I don't know, it depends on my mood. Sometimes I will like sit down and be really precise, and sometimes I just don't give a shit and I just slap it on. I think it's a bit like that with everyone though. <laughs> Name a makeup crime you hate. I don't know, I feel mean saying this and also probably hypocritical because I probably commit every makeup crime in a book. But the worst one, or the one I don't like to do, is the foundation line, which I probably have right now. I did try to blend, I always try to blend my makeup into my neck, um, especially if it's a colour that I know is too dark for me. But, you know, it's just not great when you see other people, especially in the light, broad daylight. And it's just like this line here of a different colour. It's going to be so embarrassing now if that's me today. But, you know. Do you like colourful shades of makeup or neutral ones? Um, about to pick one, I'll go colourful because I'm quite bold with my makeup. But I do really appreciate both. I think it's important to have both. What celebrity has has always has great makeup i don't think anyone always has great makeup and especially celebrities get their makeup done for them so don't idolize them but i think if i can think of one that has it on fleek would be kylie jenner probably she she's got good makeup hasn't she if you had to leave your house and you only had time to put on one makeup item slash product what would it be um mascara for definite i think mascara can transform your face in so many ways. Could you ever leave the house without your makeup on? Yeah, yeah I could, I know I do. I make an effort to go out of the house at least once a week without any makeup on. I think it's important, to be honest, I really do. Uh, I won't go into it now, but um, I think self-love and all of that. Do you think you look good even without makeup on? I think, what is this beauty tag? Because it's like some let's open up about how I feel about myself tag. Um, do I think I look good without makeup on? Honestly, I don't think I look amazing without makeup on. I like makeup because I do think it enhances my features. Um, honestly, uh, probably not, but <laughs> not a bit gay. I don't know. I don't want to like preach self-love and positivity and then have to come out and say, oh, actually, you know, it's not me, but... I also feel like being honest is, is a good thing. In your opinion, what's the best makeup line? Uh, this is hard as well because I love like all different makeup lines. But I would have to say Urban Decay simply because they have the best palettes ever. Like time after time they come out with the most pigmented, nicest shades ever. So I have to say Urban Decay. But the final question is, what do you think of makeup? I hate it, obviously. Um, I love makeup, I absolutely adore it, I think it's a great way to express myself, a great hobby to have and yeah I just think it's not for everyone but for those who do love it they shouldn't be condemned, basically. Okay that just about wraps up the questions, I hope you enjoyed it, um, hopefully got a bit of an insight into the kind of makeup I like and stuff like that. So I will be back with more videos hopefully uh hope you enjoyed the video and i will see you soon like comment and subscribe and all of that good stuff and i'll see you in my next video bye guys